Oh boy, mateys, it's Dazzling Latte, and welcome to my grocery haul. Okay, this is for two weeks. I'm going to grab out all of my receipts and stuff from the day. Let's see. Got that. I got a lot of good stuff today. Like, a lot of good stuff. Okay, let me think. There should be a Fresh Time. Yes, I went to Fresh Time today. There's a Dollar Tree receipt. There's a Big Lots receipt. There's an Aldi receipt. I found the Fresh Time receipt. Okay. So, okay. Oh I don't know why I always start a video off with blowing my nose, but ugh. Ugh. For some reason, my allergies in it. Ugh. It's so gross. Oh my gosh. Ugh. Ugh. I feel like I'm... I feel like I got a little bit of the flu. You know, not like the full flu, but I feel like I got a little bit of it. Okay, so we'll start off with Kroger, because I got a lot of stuff from Kroger. Let's see. Where's your Kroger? That. Kroger. Let's see. That's Big Lots. It's fresh time. Okay. So, first thing I got at Kroger, I needed some caffeine this morning, so I got this, and it was a dollar. It's a one liter of Coca-Cola Zero, and it does have caffeine in it. Mm. Oh, I love that. <coughs> There's nothing like the taste of it. <laughs> okay, so that's the first thing I got. And then, okay, they hit a buy six save three sale so I got let's see huh, where is it okay first thing I got was this silk protein nut milk almond and cashew and it's chocolate flavored I love chocolates I just needed like a half gallon of it I didn't need like a like two half gallons of it so I got this. I just I I want something chocolatey, you know. Valentine's Day's coming up. I need some chocolate. Okay, and that was two ninety nine. Can't remember if like oh I had a coupon for it, so it was one ninety nine. But I don't. Yeah, I think it was like. Two ninety nine on sale, and then I had a dollar off coupon, so it was one ninety nine. Okay. <laughs> and next thing I got in that sale was Pringles. Where are I got three cans of Pringles, and um, I got a dollar off coupon for them. Let's see. I think they were like 89 cents a piece before the dollar off coupon for three of them. So I think it was like a dollar something for three cans of Pringles. Okay, so I got two cans of original Pringles. Oh, I love Pringles. I love them so much. Um, and then I got a can of barbecue. Okay, and fun fact, the barbecue doesn't have dairy in it. Sometimes barbecue flavored stuff has dairy in it. Not, that makes me happy. Okay, next thing on that sale that I got. Let's see, what else was on sale? Oh, I forgot. I forgot I got some of this stuff. I'm excited. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Red gold diced tomatoes, and then they have roasted garlic and onion in them. I got two cans of them. They were 49 cents a piece. You can't beat that price. Like, you really can't. Um, next, okay. Yep, that was, that was everything I got in the buy six, save three sale. And then next, okay, I thought this was on clearance. I seriously did. But I just, 
I've been wanting to try field roast. I don't think I've tried it before, but it's like this. Okay, it looks, ah, it's artisan vegan field roast uh, grain meat sausages and it's smoked apple sage. And it looks so good. I've tried uh, tofurkey sausages before and I really liked them so I thought I'd pick this up. But I thought it, I thought it was on clearance for $3.19 and it turned out that it was $4.99. But, I, if I remember right, veggie sausages are really filling, so like I could just cut this in half. And, yeah, it's like 220 calories per sausage, so I could just like cut that in half, put it on a hot dog bun, you know, and then like a side salad, and I'm good to go, because it's like that stuff fills me up. Okay, so it's, it's not too bad, and I got a lot of good deals today, so... Um, next thing I got, oh, I got hot dog buns. They were 85 cents a piece, and they say right on the back, they're vegan. Just like, look at that thing right there. It's great. And, um, I'm pretty sure all of, like, the different brand, um, like, hot dog buns, hamburger buns, uh, the bread, I, I haven't run across any that's not, so that's that's pretty cool. Um, next is oh my god, okay, what's next? What's next? Oh, I just I showed you the stuff for the Mexican food. <laughs> this I couldn't believe. These were a dollar a package. Like, look at this. It's it's ten tortilla shells, and they're the giant tortilla shells. And it's Olay brand. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. And they just, yeah, just wheat and soy. Well, I mean, <laughs> those aren't the only two ingredients, but anyways, um, yeah. So I'm pretty sure it's like dairy free and meat free and everything, all that stuff. And yeah, they're large burrito shells. I love burritos. And I love like the giant burrito shells, so that is awesome. Um, next is pre-sliced bagels. They are the cinnamon raisin and they're Kroger brand. From what I can tell, they just like it just says contains wheat, so I, you know. And yeah, they're cinnamon raisin, okay, and it's really good. Okay. This next item is a dairy thing, and it is the Arla Original Cream Cheese Spread. So this has cheese in it, and, or like dairy in it. It's, um, I've tried this before, and it's really good. It's pretty natural, like no, not a lot of artificial things in it. Um, I had a free coupon for it, so I got it for free. Have I been listing? <laughs> I always forget to. Okay, the bagels. The bagels. What? How much were those? A dollar eighty nine uh, package. So that's pretty cool. That'll last me quite a few meals uh, for breakfast. You know. Oh, another thing for the Mexican food. I found fat free refried beans for uh, a thirty one ounce. Uh, can of it. This is a giant can. It's it's one pound fifteen ounces and it feels like it. And this is basically just this plant stuff in there pretty much. Like there's no lard in this, no dairy. I think it's kinda gross. <laughs> I'm gonna go okay, so basically I'm can't have pork anymore, can't of beef anymore and I don't know lard has always grossed me out either way and I just prefer to get the fat free ones because it tastes like Taco Bell it tastes like it did when I was growing up like we always got the fat free ones so that's cool next I got some bananas I got less than last time because I didn't eat all of them in time 
there's a whole bunch of rotten bananas up there <laughs> that, that I really need to take care of. So I got these. They were $1.17 for this bunch, and it was... Two pounds and fourteen ounces, I think. And yeah, it's like fifty-five. It was fifty-five cents a pound, so it wasn't. It was it was cheap. <laughs> okay, so one thing that I love is avocado toast, and I do have uh, bread in there, so I didn't get any bread this time. I already have some, but. Uh, Haas avocado, uh, I think uh, two for a buck, which is a really good price. Like, look at the size of that thing. Oh, I love, I love, oh, it's a little bit of dirt on there. There's, there's something, I don't know, it's just like a little funky. Okay, so yeah. Those were two for a buck. I love avocado toast. Like, it's the best thing ever. I love I love it with, like, some of that lemon pepper seasoning that I got. Oh, speaking of seasoning, there's some fun stuff coming up in the next store here. Um, but I'm not done with Kroger's stuff yet. I got some more stuff there. Yeah, that's the first bag down. Um... Okay, ooh, I got some more stuff here. Okay, let's get into this. Oh my gosh. Just Caesar. It's like Hampton Creek Caesar dressing. And it's meat free, dairy free, or egg free, dairy free. I don't know why you put well, I mean it doesn't it doesn't have fish in it. It does not have fishiness <laughs> to it. But yeah, it tastes like Caesar salad dressing. And I got it because uh, Kroger... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Keep forgetting. Okay. <laughs> I said like five times that the avocados were two for a buck, two for a buck. And I just, I, I skipped over the Hampton Creek dressing. Where is it? Where is it? Aha! Three forty nine for a, a bottle of it, and it's it's not too bad of a price because I do use this. I do use this. I love it so much. And then the Kroger waffle fries were on sale for dollar sixty nine, and I love I love me some waffle fries. Um, I haven't gotten them in a while, so I'm really excited about it. So I got these to dip into this. Oh, where do I put it? Where do I put it? I think I should open this bag back up and start putting things into it. Just plop that into there. Okay, so it's like the refrigerated stuff. Stuff I put in the fridge. Plop that into this bag. So I can just keep it a little more organized, okay? I do gotta put this stuff up after the video. And I know I'm gonna wanna try some of this stuff. Oh, this needs to go in the fridge. Did I have I been saying freezer? I'm putting this stuff in the fridge. Um okay. Oh except for this, this goes in the freezer. I got some chopped green bell peppers, and I thought this would go good in the burritos, and it was, it was a dollar. It was a dollar for this package, and it's, it's frozen. You can feel it. It's frozen. Um, yeah. So that's that, and then I got Annie's Shells and White Cheddar, which this does have dairy in it, just the sand. Um, but yeah, it's my favorite, uh, it's, it's my favorite macaroni and cheese, and it was on sale, 10 for 10, so I grabbed a box of it, you know, just for an evening when things aren't going too well, and I can just kind of, you know, just stress eat a little bit. I always do up the whole box, and then I just eat it out of a giant bowl. Um, next. 
Oh, there's one more thing that I got at Kroger. I swung back around to Kroger. Like, after all the stores. So, I'm just going to list this uh, here. And it's Whole Milk Yogurt Liberté Organic. And it's Baja Strawberry. And, um, yeah, I had a free coupon for it. And I just, whenever I have free coupons or something, I have to get it. Cause, you know, it helps the budget to stretch. And I'm going to be using this for garbage bag later. Okay, what's next? What's next? This is just like stuff that can go in the pantry. Stuff that goes in the fridge. Um, pantry. 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 Yes. Okay, so I can just kind of keep that organized behind me. Next is Dollar Tree, and I'm excited about a lot of the things I got there. Okay, fold that up. And, yeah. I hope I've been listing all the prices. I think I have been. I think I have been. It feels like it. Um, okay, so, next is Dollar Tree. First thing I have to mention is their veggie burgers. Okay, so they say vegetarian on the front, like 100% vegetarian, but it's pretty much like, um, it's just all vegetables pretty much, except for like some palm oil. I don't know. There's a controversy. I have no idea. Whatever. It's just... <laughs> is veggie burgers and I found them in the frozen food section and um, I've tried these before and they're really good they again everything at Dollar Tree is a dollar so I picked up a couple boxes of these they taste potatoey like they just they taste potatoey and um, this I, I know it says like carrots green beans and stuff but I I taste the potatoes first and foremost, just the potatoes, and I love it. Okay, so I got that, and that explains, wait, no, that's, that's the next store, never mind. <laughs> you're just, you know, you know those days when you're just, you know, it's just, I've been up since four in the morning. <laughs> Oh gosh. <laughs> okay. Next is okay, I still have pizza sauce left, so I picked myself up some more I I think this is one of the only times that I've ever bought something twice. I love trying new things, so I'm just like always buying different things, but yes. Camilo's Pizza Crusts. I got, I picked up another pack, two pack of them. And, um, yeah. And some of the other stuff that I got can, like, kind of be inter interchangeable. So I can put, you know, I got, I got some toppings. I got some toppings. Oh, and I still have some, um, hollows left. I think I still have some onion left. Like, it's, it's gonna be a nice pizza. Okay, so this is, yeah, this is pantry stuff. Oh my gosh. I saw these. I saw these at Dollar Tree, um, I think a few days ago when I filmed the last grocery haul. It was kind of like a small one before grocery day to kind of tide me over. But I saw these and I was like, no, I'm not going to get them. I'm going to get them on grocery day. I got them today. They are fudge covered gram squares and um, it just says, yeah, you can just look at the ingredients right there, right there. And there is no dairy, no, why would there be meat? That would be so gross. <laughs> we put ham in this. <laughs> but no, there's no meat, no dairy, no eggs, no Stuff. It's this fudgy, fudgy cookies, and it makes me happy. Yeah, and I think it's by a brand called Oven Baked. Um, pretty sure it's probably like a Dollar Tree brand, 
but I love thoughts of fudge cookies. I love, I love fudge. Um, next, I found this, and okay, be careful if you like. You don't have artificial colors, like like you don't eat them, um, because uh, some of the Dollar Tree seasonings. I found one that had dyes in it. So, like, be careful, read the ingredients there, but, you know, I, th this one doesn't. Um, it's French fry seasoning by Supreme Tradition, and it's, like, salt, paprika, garlic, um, onion, some, uh, an ingredient I don't recognize, and then black pepper, but it looks good, and I'm gonna put it on my waffle fries. I'm gonna see how it tastes. Oh, could you imagine putting that on a baked potato? I don't know what it tastes like. I kind of want to taste it. You know, I, 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 I have a blog. I'll, I'll, I'll do it there. I'll post about it there. Next, I found extra virgin olive oil. There. <laughs> this cute little little bottle and it's plastic so you don't have to worry about like you know dropping it and it shatters and stuff I am so bad at like life <laughs> I'm, I'm so clumsy and this this helps me when things when bottles are plastic and not glass so yes all that stuff was a dollar this is gonna be like my second pantry little bag. Okay, next. What should I do next? Um, am I going in order of? Okay, yeah, I am. <laughs> that receipt is still there. It's still there. <laughs> oh, from a few days ago. I just I never clean up things. <laughs> um. Okay, so fresh. Time was running a sale on Heidi Ho cheese, um, cheese, and uh, it was buy one get one free. And it's normally six forty nine package, and I would never pay six forty nine for one package of cheese. But yeah, they had them on sale, and I got okay. They had the ten ounce ones on sale, so I got. Um, the creamy one, which is for like mac and cheese, uh, nachos, bro like pouring on, you know, broccoli, and you can serve it hot or cold. So, um, yeah, I bet this one would be really, okay, I bet this one would be really good on the pizza, so I'm gonna try it, probably try it out on the pizza. Cause you know, I like me some mac and cheese, and putting macaroni and cheese on pizza sounds like the best thing ever. I don't have like the pasta to do so, but you know, I'll, you know, I don't have like the plain pasta and then make my own mac and cheese. And But next I got, um, okay this one is creamy chia cheese. And this one's spicy chia cheese. And they're both dye free, by the way. And, um, you look right there. Right there. Right there. Of both of them. Right there. Yes. <coughs> Ooh. Ooh. And, um, yeah, the spicy chia cheese you can put on, like, spicy seven layer dip chili con queso enchiladas and tacos and this one you can serve powder cold and, as well and um oh, this one will go so good on the burritos spicy burritos yes spicy burritos oh my gosh cheesy fries cheesy fries okay i got an idea while i was in aldi which is is that, is that the next store yes the next door. Um, I got an idea. What if, you know what, I'll save it. I'll save it for a video. Never mind. 
<laughs> I hate when people do that. It wasn't like that interesting. I, I don't know. It wasn't, it wasn't like life changing. It might be, but you never know. Okay, so. Yes, and I did. I would never forget myself if I didn't put these in the fridge and I accidentally put them in my pantry. <laughs> um. Okay, so that was fresh time. We're now on to Aldi. Okay, first thing I got was sweet bread and butter pickles. $1.69 for this giant jar of it. 24 ounces. 24 ounces. And I love, I love pickles. They would go so good on the burger. So good on the burger. And they have no certified synthetic dyes. And yeah, they don't have butter in them. This one. <laughs> I don't know why it, it I, I don't know, like if someone thought by the title, because oh, it has butter in the title, I don't know. <laughs> that would be pretty gross if you just like dipped pickles and butter. I don't know. I don't judge. But um yeah, that was a dollar sixty nine. That's just I can't believe that deal. Like I just I love me pickles. I love pickles. Oh, so good. So good. Okay, next, next, next. I got hamburger buns for the veggie burgers and they are 83 cents and on the back it says contains wheat so I don't see anything like dairy related I think um yeah so buns <laughs> uh, and they were 83 cents for this package of hamburger buns. Like, that's really good. That's really cheap. Next, I got some instant mashed potatoes, and they were $1.39 a box. And they're just like, just like regular, they're potatoes, but in powder form. And, yeah, I just, you know, I wanted to stock up. I wanted to keep some things, you know, get my pantry stocked up. Get it all stocked up. Okay, so, next. I think Big Lots is, like, the store that I'm most excited about. That's a lie. I'm excited about every store because I found something that I really love at every single store. Okay, so, Big Lots. First thing, first thing that I got, okay, right when I walked in the door, okay, so first, at Kroger I saw um, this, this new soda, like this new flavor of soda by Mountain Dew called Ice, and um, it was in like a 12 pack. I've just pretty much given up on, you know, Mountain Dew having like, I, I know that they have, they do have like a couple of dye free, you know, like naturally dyed stuff. But anyways, anyways, this, yeah, Mountain Dew Ice, I, I got this at Big Lots. I, I saw it in like the two liter form and they, it was like clear and I was like, oh, does it? It doesn't have dyes in it. And it does have caffeine in it. So it's like normal Mountain Dew. But I don't know how it's gonna taste. But yeah, it was Mountain Dew Ice. And it was 88 cents for a 2 liter. It's, it's, it's such a good price. Such a good price. And next, okay. Next, I ate this in the car. I was so hungry. Um, it's like... Yeah, it was probably about lunchtime, kind of, we weren't big lots, so, like, I just, this was my breakfast. <laughs> and, you know, when you get kind of car sick and you don't want to eat in the morning, that's kind of the way I am on grocery day, but then, like, halfway through the day, I'm like, I need food. But, yeah, I got a Luna bar at Big Lots for 70 cents. 
I couldn't believe it. Um, it's like a caramel, salted caramel cashew. It has no dairy in it from what I can see. Okay. And yeah, that was 70 cents. Um, next is this giant bag of goodies that I got. Oh, 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 and it's in a big ass reusable bag. They, years ago they had them. And anyways, I, I have one now. <laughs> Uh, okay. So, first thing I got was these Earthly Choice Chia Seeds. And they were at, I, look, look, look. A dollar a package. And you, oh, I got two packages. I got two packages. They were a dollar a package. I got 24 ounces of Chia Seeds for two bucks. I'm so happy. These these are usually pretty pricey. Not like really pricey, but like you know, two nineteen for a small container, and then you get like. But, like <gasps> but no, when I saw that, I just, just just jumped at the chance to get those. Um, next, I found these uh, Snyder's of Hanover. They're like buffalo, hot buffalo wing uh, flavored pretzels. And it's kind of weird, but like they don't have... I, I was looking at them and I don't see any like um, meat products. And I also don't see any dairy in it. So... Like, we'll look at that. You can look at the ingredients and, like, pause the video. I don't know how well you can see it. But, yeah, and it's peanut-free for anyone who has a peanut allergy. That that must be awful. I love peanut butter. I feel so sorry for anyone who has a peanut allergy. Okay, next, I found these really cool, I think they're, like, artisan sodas, maybe? I don't know. Um, but they're like, they're called Only Natural, and this one's raspberry ginger, 33 cents. All of these were 33 cents, by the way, these sodas right here. I got one in grapefruits, yeah, pomelo and peach, I don't know what, um, this one's 30 calories a uh, bottle, and this one's 15 calories a bottle. And then this one's zero calories a bottle, and it's hibiscus, pomegranate, strawberry. <laughs> oh, I was trying not to get that one. <laughs> okay, I just, I have a bit of a pomegranate allergy. <laughs> Crap. Uh, but, like, I'll still have it. <laughs> I know that's bad. That's bad. But like, I don't. I don't think my face will swell up that much, and um, I really want to try it. And um, yeah, <laughs> I don't recommend. Like, I don't have that bad of allergic reaction. I just get like a little bit lightheaded. My face swells up a little bit, and it's. But it's when I have a lot of it, so I just like I'm not gonna put it back in my diet. But like, I just. I, I want I want to try some strawberries. <laughs> I don't recommend this. Don't do as I do with like having pomegranate and you're allergic to it. I don't know. <sighs> I need more sleep. Um, don't worry, I might not drink it, but I'll probably drink it. But it's so pretty. It's so pretty. <laughs> Anyways, the next thing I got was, you, you never see this at this price, by the way. Starbucks Double Shot Energy Hazelnut Flavored Coffee, and it's it was 87 cents a can. Yes, and there is milk in this, just like there's dairy in this. And I got two of them. Um, just because, like, that's a really good price. You never see it at that price. It's usually $1.25. Okay, is that everything? I think that's everything that I've got today. Oh, 
gosh, I'm probably going to have the scissors now. Oh, man. It's just... Oh, ooh, that's spicy. That's spicy. I think some of it went in my eye. Oh, gosh. That's... That looks tasty. Mmm. Oh, it's spicy. Mmm. Tastes slightly like sriracha. It's a bit of a lime flavor to it. Mmm. Okay, it has cayenne peppers in it. Oh. There's a sweetness. But also the spiciness. I don't even like pretzels, so take my word for this. This is good. Mm. Mm. Okay, they're mm. okay. It says lactic acid. <coughs> so I don't know if that's like a cheese thing. I don't know. Anyways. But doesn't list milk as one of the like allergens, so I don't know. Mm, good. All right. I should in a video instead of just like sitting here eating, but okay. So that was my grocery haul. I'm really excited about all the things I got. I'm drooling a little bit. Okay, so for now, I have to go open until I'm smooth sailing to get you and your pirate crew. I've been filming for 40 minutes. <laughs> 